Hello, hello, today I'm going to show you how to use one contact neon test lights. A low cost type of test lamps only contacts one side of the circuit under test and relies on stray capacitance and current passing through the user's body to complete the circuit. The device may have the form of a screwdriver like this model as shown. The device may have the form of an, a pen maybe, I think, maybe it's possible. The tip of the test is touched to the conducting beam tested. For example, we will use a le an electric socket, but you can use an electric wire as well. A neon lamp takes very little current to light and juice can use a user's body capacitance to earth ground to complete the circuit. Screwdriver type test lamps are very inexpensive but cannot meet the construction requirements of UK GS38. If the shaft is exposed, the shock hazard to the users exists and the internal construction of the test provides no protection against short circuit faults. So that means it's not really sure that this will be not a live line. So maybe if you like to be more sure, use a multimeter or a dust pole to test this um, socket, electric socket. But in this case, it's a cheap one contact neon test light. Easy to use, but it's not so nice and sure. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe me and give me a positive feedback. And see you next time. Soon, soon.